Your thoughts, guys? The strategy is simple. Get a quick score and foul right away. Everybody has got to be in the exact perfect position defensively, and execution has got to be on point. Yes! Doncic relishes the opportunity to deliver in big moments. And my goodness, embrace the spotlight, young man. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Good on the first. And that gives him a four-point cushion. And a tough break as his second attempt is no good at the line. From deep, here's Doncic. Money. And that one brings him within one. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. At the line. And no good on the second free throw. So 0 for 2 there. And here's Doncic. Oh, the all or nothing shot attempt falls off live. The Mavericks, 79. That's the game, folks. Thank you all for coming out and showing your support. We hope to see you again soon. And the Charlotte Hornets are your new NBA champions. And all you can say is congratulations. They have done it. A lot of relief right now. The emotions swelling up from all the weight being lifted and winning it all. Wow. An incredible display of resilience. Seemingly every time they were challenged, Grant, they rose to the occasion. NBA, I have to give props to the front office for making all the right moves. And the coaching, just phenomenal. And then, hey, it's a player's league. Those guys came out and took care of business. And thanks to everyone out there who's been with us through this entire journey. Take care, and we'll see you next season. What's up, everybody? Congratulations on winning the finals MVP. <laughs> right? Nate, my man, thank you, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just want to give a shout out, man, because you've been here since day one, bro. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. And yeah, that's what I wanted to ask you. Uh, when you got drafted last year, did you ever imagine this happening like today? Honestly, man, I ain't even gonna sit up here and lie to you. Nah, I didn't. You know, of course, you know, I dreamed that someday, you know, I'll make it to the finals and I hit the game winning shot. You know, I think every kid growing up had that dream in their driveway. You know what I'm saying? But for it to happen so quickly, nah, man, I had no idea. Wait, but really, at what point did you think this team mm -hmm. was a serious contender for the title? Ooh, um, I'd probably say like around around All-Star break. Ooh. You know, that's, that's kind of when it started to feel like, okay, you know, we, we can compete with anyone in this league kind of thing, you know? And it took a little longer for it to prove it, you know, but the seeds were there. They were definitely there, so we started believing in ourselves from that moment on, you know? So tell me, is there anything else left for you to achieve? All done? 
All right, thanks, guys. All right, let's do this. Who's first? Congratulations on winning the NBA championship, Ooh, man. My man, Nate. My man, Nate. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. It's been great having you here since day one. Well, you know, uh, it's been an honor of mine, of course. But my question is this, and it's real simple. How does it feel to come into the league as a rookie and help lead this team to a championship? <sighs> You know, Nate, I am just delighted for the fans, the franchise, you know, all the people who have been working here and supporting this team for all these years. You know, they're the ones who waited for this. Me, I just got here. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, you did just get here. And yet, you seem to have made all the difference. I mean, did you think this would have happened eventually, if not so soon? Yeah, you know, I thought we would eventually bring a title to this city. Um, Everyone who gets drafted hopes for that outcome. But to do it so quickly, I, you know, I can only take small credit um, for that. You know, this franchise was built by many hands, and I'm just playing my part. Now that you've won a title in your rookie year, what else is left? I mean, have you accomplished your goals? Well, originally, my goal was to just get to the league. That's it. And then I wanted to be a first round pick. Uh, but then once I got here, I wanted to start. And then I wanted to get a playoff series win. You know, the list can go on, you know? <laughs> Basically what I'm saying is as you achieve your goals, you adjust and you find other challenges to keep you growing. Wow, I mean, that's a, that's a lot accomplished. So what are some of your new challenges going forward? Well, one thing I'm really expanding on this year was uh, my fashion game. <laughs> Yeah, man, my fashion game, you know. Uh, I got to know Callaway Shields, uh, this great new designer, Audrey Louise Reynolds, and uh, they've been taking me under their wing. So I'm just hoping to make moves in that front, and, you know, this summer and, and beyond and keep going with it. Mm. All right, cool. Uh, I think I'm done. You guys have a good night. You see me, I eat, sleep, and talk rap. You see that 98 Mercedes on TV, I bought that. I had some 